Hello and welcome back to Hearthstone. My name's Lumen and right now we're gonna jump back into the old Tavern Brawl. And I think this time around we're gonna try an Undertaker Hunter. I am excited to see that work again. I don't know if it's going to work. I'm putting a lot of faith in my deck building abilities. But it's something that I personally actually liked when it was a thing back in the day. I'd like to see happen again. So that's it. <laughs> that's the deck done. Uh, well, not exactly. Death Rat. That's not gonna work. Unfortunately, I don't think the Explorer's hat's gonna work. Because... As far as I know... That'll just put the 1-1 one -one on them, then they're not gonna get an extra 1-1 one -one or anything like that. So, I'm not certain how this is gonna work. I think that if I play that, then it'll actually be a 1-3, which is kind of great. Is this good? Is what I'm doing good? This needs... I don't think it is. <laughs> it needs to be much more aggressive. Hold on. So... Uh, one of those, because I'm trying to make this a deck that'll actually win. I did put the Mad Scientist in, so we're going to put some explosive traps in. And... Quick shots. I mean, I always like quick shot. It's always good. Need to put one more trap in, though. I think we'll make it two explosive, one... Snake or... Snake. I kind of like explosive and snake. Works. Eagle on bow. Wow. We've got a lot on two. Animal companion. Not enough death rattle, or what? Damn. Feign death. We're gonna need more death rattle. For feign death to actually work. Let's just be, be aggressive. This is not... <laughs> This is not the Undertaker Hunter from back in the day. <laughs> this is something entirely different and uh, no doubt much worse. Am I biting off more than I can chew with the whole trap thing? Let's remove the Glaive Zuka. One of the Savannah High Mains. We'll keep Sneeds. Oh! I haven't been able to use this yet. Ah. Uh. The Clockwork Gnomes? I like those. Maybe I'll actually put the Web Spinners in as well. Remove something from two. Let's remove the traps. And the Mad Scientist. Because we can have more fun without them. That's for sure. I honestly don't even mind Death Lords. I'm gonna go with them. I played a Death Lord Hunter for quite a bit on the ladder, and it's just, it's decent. Death Lord Hunters, it's quite good. And then one Unleash the Hounds. Oh, uh, we can remove the Eagle on Bows as well. Animal Companions, great. Let's go with that. It's a little weird. Like, not putting more death rattle in, instead of some of this stuff that I've got in here. But, I think... Okay, Harvest Golem. Let's put Harvest Golem in, instead of Animal Companion. Here we go. Now, we kind of lack in draw, but I think we can make up for it by high value plays. Like, the minions and stuff that we're going to be playing, they are going to probably be going two for one most of the time, so... That'll be good. But again, I, I do think we're missing some draw. Maybe... Sir Finley would have been good. So that I can maybe get the uh, Warlock hero Ameria ability. Oh, this is interesting. What do we think he's playing? Maybe he's playing Aggro Shaman. The might of the elves. This is nice. I'll drop that. Uh, 
Farron Rivendell and Death Lord together. Maybe not so great. I think Web Spinner. But maybe Ruby and Egg Turn 1 is best. Yeah. Oh, Mulox, okay. It's fine. <laughs> That's so good, right? So, so good. Having it just be a 1 3 immediately. It's like you used the Defender of Argus on it already, but you didn't. Well, now. What a spoil sport. The Death Lord could be pretty significant. If he doesn't get some big stuff out soon. Yeah, it's not gonna help you very much. I'm going two for one with this. Feels bad, man. He actually just used his Earth Shock. <laughs> and getting a Murloc out from the the Death Lord is, is actually kind of bad. Because a lot of the Murlocs, you actually want to have trigger the death rattles. Oh, he can do this, he can kill this. He's got enough damage, but he's gonna have to trade everything in. And then I just kill that, wow, wow. Feels really bad, man. Oh, oh, okay, so you can use this and that, or this and that. See, that's a wasted death rattle. Uh, not a death rattle, that's a wasted battle cry. Okay. Do I want to do this? No, I need to. I need to put that there. So, I think we're going to go with. I think we can go with Undertaker. Bring out your dead. Hey, give me that. Scary. Man, if he can leave these on the board, if he can just leave them on the board a little bit. Riven Deer. Ooh. He's gonna be good in the next turn. So he didn't get spell power. Was he fishing for spell power? Oh my god, this is gonna be great. He's gonna go face, isn't he? Oh, man. Here we are. Here we are. It has to be this. So I want this one to die so he can double dip the damage. Hey, give me that. But first I want this to die. Wow. That would have been nice right now. Uh, see, it's kind of pointless letting it die for nothing. So rather we put this here. Wow. Okay. You're dead. We put this on, on one of these, I suppose. Oh. And that on there. I, I don't know. I, I like the idea of using Feign Death in the next turn, but then again, it's just on the toad. Is he crackling, Rivendell? Thank you, I guess. It's going to be quite valuable as well. Well, he's got Riven there. You can put those on there. Well, why did we put that there? It's so inconsistent. Okay, he's going to concede now. I want to trade one out first. I might not even need to use Unleash the Hounds. Six. That's just so strong. Wow. Wow. This seems infinitely better than the Paladin Murloc deck I made. Murloc Paladin deck I made. Sure. 
True, I mean, he's just not having a great game. That's something you always gotta keep in mind. Your opponent's game. But still, this is... Wow. Now, he's having a terrible game, I'd say. Still 28 life, though. I can pop out some hyenas. I could go unleash. I could just play this. To be perfectly honest, this is actually not bad. Although, no, let's do... Mm. Damn, there are so many choices. Yeah, fine. He's already struggling so much dealing with what I've got out. Let's let him further... Put that there. Further develop his board. And we'll just... I don't know. Capitalize off whatever happens. Oh, actually gonna be full up. Wow. Oh, at least I got Sneeds. Nothing else is really even worth having. The rest of the stuff that I've got is pretty bad. He says just before drop-ins and then really important. Let's see what gets burned. Oh, I absolutely have to try and kill him. I'm sitting here thinking I got 100% control of this game, but I'm actually not in control. Oh, I didn't burn anything. Good. Actually not in control. Wait, do I have lethal? It's the quest. This, this egg. Wow. This egg. Do I have lethal? Seven. Uh, if I play one death rattle minion, then this will be enough to kill one of those. Damn, I gotta clear everything up quickly. So... Play one death rattle, dude. I don't know, like... Uh, this guy. Put you there. I'm gonna put... I, I can't even use Unleash the Hounds. That's what sucks so much right now. I probably had lethal there and I just missed it completely. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> I just, okay, I, I shuffled things around a little away, in ways they weren't meant to be shuffled. It was so bad, I just, I had no idea what was going on there. It's fine, I, I win. Unless he has, oh, Murkai and Rockbiter. That has to be Murkai and Rockbiter, or Murkai and Crackle. I can't play Murkai and Crackle. Has to be Murkai and Rockbiter. That's a Taunter, so that helps me as well. I have, I have so many tools, and I'm just not able to use them correctly. Uh, yeah, I really want to put this out. But then I might be dooming myself. Because yeah, that's probably bloodlust. Mm. Looking at it now, that's what I think it is. Okay, fine. We're gonna whip spinner it. Hope we get some enough taunt. That's taunt. <laughs> I got another huge toad. That's pretty cool. Okay, taunt goes on here. Then we want to start clearing stuff out. What do I have to attack with these two? This has to go face. Give me another taunt. Wow. Wow. I did not expect that they'd give me another taunt. I'm still susceptible here. I can definitely still die. I should have been using my hero ability every turn. Oh yeah, okay, he's dead. Shame. He's just not drawing anything good. Aha, so he had Murkai. <laughs> he miscalculated. <laughs> you win this 
Shame, because he attacked with the other Murloc first, then Murkai got weaker. I've done that kind of thing before. That feels pretty bad. Feign Death is not great, right? It just seems to me like Feign Death is not helping all that much. It's sort of a fun gimmick, instead of actually being useful. We're gonna try one more game. I imagine Fatigue slash Freeze Mage is incredibly good with a spell bonus. Getting extra armor the whole time. How are you gonna lose? Or like a spell-based warrior with all the armor and stuff in it already. So whenever you play a spell, you get extra armor. You just go Fatigue, you go Spells, Heals, and Armor. Just everything. Like armor from minions and stuff. There's so many things. You could potentially do. Damn, I should have played more of this brawl. I really should have. Of course. Sniper? I like that name. Oh my god. I actually well clicked. Met. I clicked there. Bring out your dead. Hello. That was close. Almost messed it up again. I got like the perfect hand. Murlocs. Of course it's Murlocs. Come on, Undertaker. Do good for me. It's already too late. This Undertaker is not gonna do it. I think I play the value game because of the way Murlocs work. Because of the way this works. My dude's always just gonna be so much bigger than his. That's unfortunate. For him. That's a bad turn two, is what I'm saying. Would have been a good turn one. Okay, and that improves it greatly. I see. Still gonna put that there. Oh no, I should put that there. Yeah man, with the plus one one that you get on the death rattle minions, everything's just way too strong. And if he does not clear this out, which I think he might not. I honestly think he might just go face. Then double feign death in the next turn is gonna be so bad. Oh my god. A mistake. Oh, this is gonna be great. My regrets. I have to double feign death, right? I gotta do it. Wait, 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 do I do it again? That's the choice right now. Is between, I think, Huge Toad and Feign Death again. Yeah, let's Feign Death again. It's fun. That's the reason we're doing it. Yeah, I'm playing a serious value game here. I always end up with double quick shot in my hand right at the start of the game. Tells me he doesn't have Consecrate. Good. Good, good, good. Made the same mistake I made when I made my Warlock dick. To the face. Is he gonna play Murloc Knight? Oh no. Okay. I honestly feel like the Death Rattle bonus is just way too strong. For me, in a good way, of course. I like that it's strong. Uh, kinda, kinda like this bonus more. Seeing that I've got a bunch of quick shots, I think I'm okay with this. By bunch, I mean two. Oh, Sneed. I really want to get Sneeds out. It's one of my favorite legendaries that I never get to play because... Ah, this doesn't really work. Thing is, right now, he is actually doing a reasonably good job at just keeping me down and out. I'm going to want to start going to face now. Depending on what I draw, I guess. Oh wow. See, he's gonna have to start worrying. I 
There's no uh, bloodlust on Paladin that he can just pop and then go face. He's gonna have to start worrying about this because this is like a two turn lethal that we're looking at. Don't be Murkai. This will. I was gonna say, enforce the point that I always try and push across. To oh, he's just going face. Now I trade and he's got nothing left, right? I think that's what I gotta do. I need to use quick shot here, unfortunately. Do I? I guess I don't need to use quick shot. At seven, he's gonna have to kill this one. So we'll see what pops out there, I guess. Ooh, five to face. Man, he's really valuing these little Murlocs and he's very highly. Well, on the plus side, I get to place needs now. literally the only plus side because I can't I can't actually look it's paladin I don't think he's gonna have any buffs so two three four five six seven damage there's no way he's gonna pull seven damage out unless that's blessing of kings and he picks up another blessing oh oh murkai murkai right oh, murkai shit. yes okay so I got a trade unfortunately uh how are we gonna do it the ones with two attack can die first for the dragon queen Oh, but not really, right? For the Dragon Queen. I kind of want more dudes out, so... But I, I guess I want this guy dead as well. Now. For the Dragon Queen. So now Murkai is not lethal. It's two, three, four, five. One more Murloc there. Oh, but that and Murkai might be lethal. For, yeah, this is really close. 6, 10, 11. If that's Murkai, then I'm dead. If it's not, then I actually just win. Oh, you know what that is? That's anything can happen. That's what that is. He's got to make the value trades now. Oh, I think he just lost the game. Because he can't play anything can happen in the next turn. And I'm about to clear the board. Oh, wow. Unfortunately, I can't kill this off. Is it lethal? 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Am I seriously one off lethal? Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's... That's rough. My god. Okay. So that's a thing. We can afford everything, so I guess we can just put it all out. Oh no, but do we even want to? I guess I want to get rid of these. Like this, and like that. Like that, and like that, and like that. Should be good. Unless that's the coin and anything can happen was just drawn. Then you might have a chance. Yeah, that's the only combination. I don't even think War Leader plus Murkai will win it for him. Oh, that's definitely not going to win it. Wow. Tough game. That's where he concedes, I guess. Would have liked to have seen what was inside Sneeds. Oh wait, hold on. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It's exactly 13. Yeah. Okay. Well, there we go. Well played. Well played. 
Not bad. I I think this definitely, like I said at the start, works better than my Murloc deck that I made. But it's not... What is going on over here? It's not optimized by any stretch of the imagination. Not at all. Ah, huh. Battle of the Bulls. I kind of like it. And again, I would have liked to have spent a bit more time with it, but... I guess it just wasn't meant to be this time around. Next time, definitely. So if you guys give me any hints and tips, uh, maybe they'll be useful. The next time this Tavern Ball comes up, I'm sure we're going to see this one again. If they give us stats or something, we'll probably see that this one is quite highly ranked. Maybe not right at the top, but quite highly. So, check back here soon for more. Give it a like, share it, and do all your stuff. Most importantly though, happy Battle of the Builds. Happy that. Thank you.